All right, students, I've got my grandpa glasses on, so you know um, I have to read something off the screen here, but uh, we kind of have to have a, not a serious, but a, definitely a very informed discussion about the approaches to learning for this class, or the ATLs, which are part of the learner profile of students here at ACS. It's different than a lot of schools. So let's really uh, talk about this just for a moment because you are graded on these things and you get ATL scores in your report cards. So let's talk about what it looks like in this classroom. So I have some notes on my screen here. Uh, well, the, the four ATLs, of course, are um, collaboration, uh, self-directed learning, responsibility, and global citizenship. So let's talk about what they look like in exploring technology. So collaboration, that is um, that you come in prepared for class. So you, you're ready to go that way. Uh, you are focused on the task because let's say you're on a team, you're collaborating, you need to be prepared, you need to be focused, and you need to treat those other people on the team with respect so that everybody is pulling along. We know that a lot of group projects can be kind of out of balance, but here in Exploring Technology, we expect them to be balanced, everybody pulling their own weight. Okay, when it comes to the ATL of responsibility, that's also ready for class. Your battery on your MacBook is charged, you've got headphones, you've got other accessories, maybe your project needs a few things from home, maybe you need to wear a scarf in a video, bring that scarf to school, okay, so it's ready to go. Uh, your water bottle is, is full, everything's, you know, everything is ready to go, you're ready for class, that's responsibility. Also responsibility is using your time wisely. We've only got a certain number of weeks to get these projects done. That means every class is important. Every minute of every class is important, okay? And we want to see you doing well with that, okay? Remember, one of the other points we grade on is consistently. Are you consistently working hard in class? Uh, also under responsibility is using your time wisely. So you have something new that you need to figure out. Well, get right down to it. Find some tutorials and figure out how this thing works, okay? Use your time wisely rather than uh, just wasting it. That's really important. Um, now, self-directed learning. This is a big one in this class and it's gonna drive you crazy because you are driving this bus of learning, okay? If you get something, again, I'm just gonna hold up my little clock and you're gonna use this, you've gotta figure out how it works, okay? You find the tutorials, you find the websites, you find the articles, you go find a book in the library, you take care of this, okay? If you don't understand how, how animation works, then go figure it out. If you don't understand how a mixer board operates, there are hundreds of videos that teach you how mixer boards operate. You have got to take responsibility for your learning in self-directed learning. This class is all about, especially tech, because tech can change from week to week, moment to moment, and there's no way we could have a textbook for this class. Instead, we leave it up to you to figure out how things go. Now, our roles as teachers are to encourage you or to help you, sometimes give you the proper name of things because you might like, I have no idea what to even look this up on the internet as, and we could say, oh, it's a timer clock. You know, like we could give you those type of things because we understand the names of different things. But we can't go off and give 24 different lessons to 24 different students on how things work in the class. Self-directed learning, okay? Um, you keep yourself on pace so that you can finish everything on time. Uh, you push yourself to try new things. None of this, well, you know, I don't like to get in front of the camera. Give it a try. This is the, a safe environment to do that. Uh, under, cit uh, under citizenship here, we uh, respect the work of others. So we don't make fun of other people's work, especially everybody's learning. You know, if we were all learning to ride the bicycle the first time and you already knew how to ride the bicycle and you're great at it, you can do jumps and everything. Well, of course it might look silly to somebody who's like, wobbling along and, and having a hard time. But we respect the work of others and we help them and we encourage them. We're positive, we're supportive. That's what citizenship means and we hold on to the ACS core values. Okay, so that's what the ATLs and, and such looks like in this class. I want you to be really aware of them because we're gonna be going around and grading you on them constantly to see how you're doing. And this is the perfect class to try them all out and we wish you the best of luck.